In hydrolysis, the substrate binds to the active side of the enzyme. The substrate could be, for instance, glucose, and the enzyme to break it down would be glucase. A water molecule comes along and breaks apart the substrate, so the substrate will move away from the enzyme and a new substrate will come in to be broken down. Oh no, what's this? Oh, it looks like the substrate. Oh, oh, he's going. He plants the landing, and oh, here comes the water. It's the water here molecule. The it's bonding. It's bonding. And it's good. In dehydration, two substrates entered the active site, and a water molecule is removed between the two to bind them together. Then, the single product leaves the active site, and two more substrates come in. What's this? There's two of them. They're headed straight for the active site. Ooh, what a hit. Oh, knocked the water right out of them. A competitive inhibitor is a chemical that interferes with the active site so that substrate, in this case glucose, cannot bind with the enzyme. A non-competitive inhibitor binds to the enzyme and changes the shape of the active site so the substrate cannot bind to the active site. This has been a Steady Hand Hennigan production.